Perhaps the space stations of today will ultimately lead to a return to Earth's largest space station, the Moon. Rocky asteroids and icy comets have crashed into the moon and pockmarked its face. Each comet impact also delivered water ice to this dry world. At the poles, colonies in perpetual twilight can mine the moon for this trapped ice. far side is quiet and undisturbed by radio noise blaring from Earth. In these silent, wide-open spaces, rows of radio dishes made from lunar materials capture images of distant galaxies and listen for signals from distant alien worlds. Astronauts will mine surface rocks for oxygen to breathe and to use as rocket fuel. They can cast its soil into beams rods, plates, tubes, and glass fibers. The moon has solar energy with no atmosphere to block sunlight during the long lunar day. Then solar power stations made of lunar materials will collect sunlight and beam the energy to Earth as microwaves. The moon is rich in an energy fuel called helium-3, produced in the sun's core. For billions of years, this stardust has fallen on the moon, while Earth's atmosphere blocks it from settling on Earth. The moon's helium-3 could fuel tomorrow's nuclear fusion reactors on Earth. protects the genome of life. The greatest threat to life on Earth is probably the impact of an asteroid or comet. Such a direct hit destroyed more than half of the species on Earth 65 million years ago. An Earth impact will not damage ecosystems on the moon. support enclosed terrestrial biospheres, complete with plants and animals for oxygen, food, and companionship. Life on the moon may become so pleasant that visitors dread returning to the oppressive gravity pull of Earth. Here, a 120-pound human weighs only 20 pounds and can jump six times higher than on Earth. In a pressurized dome, humans wearing wings can actually fly. The Lunar 
Olympic Games will break all terrestrial records, featuring pole vaults of more than 120 feet, long jumps more than 180 feet, weightlifting of more than an earth ton. graceful gymnasts leaping six times higher than they can on Earth. Welcome to the future moon. Sustainable, self-sufficient, and profitable. A producer of solar power and fusion fuel. A source of raw materials to build, launch, and fuel tomorrow's spaceship. A home for the first humans to call another world home. <laughs>